Hi, you guys. This is Prophetess Ophelia Sabrina Acapo and wanted to bring you another prophetic word that the Holy Spirit spoke into my spirit on today. And as with any prophetic word, you will absolutely want to go to the Lord in prayer, testing the spirit to affirm and confirm that perhaps this prophetic word is for you. Holy Spirit, I invite you in to take full charge, to take full control, to take full access. I decrease as you increase. Allow me to bring forth your word with your glory, with your power, with your grace, with your mercy, telling your story so your name can be glorified for the winning of souls to the gospel of Jesus Christ. In Jesus Christ's mighty name that I do pray. Amen, 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 and amen. Title of this prophetic word, you guys is the heavens are releasing your resources and sources. The heavens are releasing your resources and sources. So you guys, I'm actually eating my food earlier and the Holy Spirit began to speak. And I put down plate and all to get instead my spiritual food and word. And the Holy Spirit is saying there is an outpour and an overflow that's taking place even now. The heavens are releasing your resources and sources. And I just heard the Holy Spirit say he's leading you to sources and resources that are going to make you rich and add no sorrow. Because you have been asking and even anticipating by faith this change, and the Lord has heard your cry. Holy Spirit gave me scripture of Philippians 4 and 19, and my God will fulfill all your needs according to his riches and glory in Christ Jesus. Holy Spirit is causing you to be launched out in the deep and on a different genre even an increase in your revenue. Matthew 18 and 18. I assure you most solemnly and most solemnly say to you, excuse that whatever you bind, forbid, declare to be improper and unlawful on earth shall have already been bound in heaven. And whatever you loose, permit, declare lawful on earth shall have already been loosed in heaven. Holy Spirit is saying where you were not able to make ends meet, I'm leading you to the land of more than enough. Ephesians 3 and 20. And exceedingly, abundantly above all that you could ever ask or think according to the power that is at work on the inside of you. Holy Spirit is saying your intentionality and your persistent faith paved the way for blessings to overtake you because you made a decision conscientiously to hearken unto the voice of the high calling of the Lord. And I hear you're about to be blessed in the city, blessed in the field, blessed coming in, blessed going out. You will be the head and not the tail. You will be above and not beneath. You will be a lender and not a borrower. You are about to be debt free and the sources and resources is bringing about a release on a higher plateau. Deuteronomy 15 and 1. At the end of every seven years, you shall grant a release, remission, pardon from debt. Deuteronomy 15 and 2. This is the regulation for the release. Every creditor shall forgive what he has loaned to his neighbor. He shall not require repayment from his neighbor and his brother because the Lord's release has been proclaimed. Holy Spirit is saying a clean slate of debt cancellation on, even for some of you guys, on your credit report. Holy Spirit is leading you to sources for home ownership, even down payment assistance program sources. Some of you, Holy Spirit is further saying, will even be getting a home and there will be no down payment required. The transition and transformational sources and resources are now being released, says the Lord. 
and you have reached your open level of increase and release. Open heaven and open doors. Sources and resources are raining down in your life, even chasing you down. You're not going to even be looking for it. But the Holy Spirit is saying it's about to fall in your lap. Blessings are about to locate you. They are coming upon you and overtaking you. Deuteronomy 28 and 2. All these blessings will come upon you and overtake you. If you pay attention to the voice of the Lord your God. You have entered your season of wealth transfer, says the Lord. Deuteronomy 8 and 18. But you shall remember with profound respect the Lord your God. For it is he who is giving you power to make wealth that he may confirm his covenant, which he swore solemnly promised to your fathers as it is this day. The heavens are releasing your sources and resources. Thus said the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. And don't forget to hit that notify bell where you guys can be notified each time I upload a video. Welcome, 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 welcome to all of my new subscribers, you guys. Welcome to the fam. I pray that the rhema words have definitely permeated, absorbed, flowed, and saturated your spirit, and you were able to get a revelation and understand that you have never done before because the door has been opened. The Lord is saying resources and sources are available to you, and they're going to overtake you. You're not going to even be looking for it, and they're going to start pouring in, and once they start pouring in, the Lord is saying there's going to be nonstop. The Lord is wanting to make sure you're getting this best, and the Lord is wanting to make sure that you're going to reach the top. You're going to a different plateau. The Lord is saying, even for some of you guys, a different tax break. The Lord is saying he's changing and rearranging things. This is your transition and transformational time to shine. And I hear Isaiah 60 and 1, arise, shine, for your light has come and the glory of the Lord has risen upon thee. The heavens are releasing your sources and resources, thus said the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. And I love each and every one of you guys. I am constantly praying for each and every one of you guys. May the Lord richly bless each and every one of you guys and see each and every one of you guys through to the greatness of success of God's best. And I want to tell you guys once again, thank you so much for all that you do. It does not go unnoticed. Thank you for sowing into this ministry. It is greatly appreciated. Lord, I want to take the time out to honor you, to magnify you, to glorify you, to adore you, to exalt your holy name, to lift your name on high for you are worthy to be praised. Thank you for bringing this word forth of the heavens are releasing your sources and resources. Thank you for speaking to me and providing me the opportunity to bring the story so your name can be glorified for, by me bringing forth the chapters of every page of the book to make sure I am leading your people out of obscurity into the land of promise. And this is the month to do it. The heavens are releasing your sources and resources. Does say of the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Take care, you guys. And once again, I love each and every one of you guys. I am constantly praying for each and every one of you guys. We will most certainly talk on the next, and God bless you. Talk to you soon.